Hello everybody, welcome to Informacy.com. Remember this game, I'm Sean Conway and I got another game for y'all to try to remember. Another one of these games might be something that you might want to re-pick up later on. And this game today is Shinobi for the PlayStation 2. It was a game that would have been on the Dreamcast, but since PlayStation destroyed them, it was on the, the um, PlayStation 2. So I'm going to jump into this game. Like, subscribe, let me know what you think about it. And ring a ding on that bell. And I'm jumping into the intro. All right, hopefully everything boots up correctly. We're going to jump into this really good game. You know, there's Shinobi and then there's Ninja Gaiden or Gaiden, whatever one you want to uh, call it. And they both kind of look alike, but for whatever reason, I like the Shinobi a little bit more. It's a little weird. Of course, I like the Ninja Gaiden, Gaiden, on the NES. Na, 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 na. Sega. Presented by Sega. I don't understand why Sega don't just go ahead and make another console. I mean, it's not that big of a deal. They have made retro little consoles. Might as well go ahead and do a little hybrid handheld. They got the money in to do so. They're scared. Shinobi. Ah. I'm just going to go to a new game. Try and see. What was the backstory of this character? Did they didn't make any other sh uh, Shinobi games? I feel like. I, thank you for all I almost want to say this is the only one that's in 3D. Leave a comment below if I'm right or wrong. It feels like it's the only one. It's it's really pretty looking. I give you that. This is the way it must be done. This is ridiculous. This is ridiculous. You, you know what? I'm going to skip all this. Can I skip this? Because what we want to see is gameplay. Four years later. See, games like this needs to be preserved. This is this is like history. And then they wonder why people pirate stuff like this because we want to remember uh, we want to learn they need like a like a library of some sort so if somebody want a physical uh, copy of this game the library can print it out like we pass through if they're going to make it an all digital world might as well you know let some library print out and dispute Redistribute re, um, these old retro games. Oh my gosh, I, I missed that. I think I can run on walls. Can I? Oh, okay. Alright, so I can turn with the analog stick. I can move around. Oh shoot. Ninjas. Okay. I wonder if anybody ever beat this game. I never went on YouTube to see if anybody has fully beaten this game. These dogs. Okay. Oh. For the PlayStation, this is amazing. I mean, it doesn't look as good as Ninja Gaiden on the Xbox, but it's not bad. It's, the, it's its own flavor. Ooh, I like, I don't know why I always like making the scarf do that. Come on. Oh. But it really feels no different. Two different developers pretty much made the exact same type of game, and it feels the exact same. 
which makes me wonder like was like did they get me collaborated when they made these two different games hmm Why am I why am I fighting a tank? This has like a little nightcrawler thing. Have y'all ever played the Sega Genesis of X-Men? Nightcrawler could like teleport. Oh. This feels more like Nightcrawler than anything else. Uh, I can't even go to the next part of the stage until I'm done with that. Then I get all the bad guys. Alright. I don't like that part, that's kind of weird. Oh shoot. Now, believe it or not, I don't know why, but like... The analog stick is inverted a little bit. I'm, I guess I could fix that in, in, in the control settings, but who thought that was a good idea in the first place? This is a really dark game. Where am I going? Oh. Slash, slash, slash. Yeah, the whole blood thing don't really work well on the PlayStation. Like once you do it for a while, it gets kind of plain and boring. Can can I just okay? It's like they purposely put these checkpoints so I won't speed through these uh, this level. There's some boxes. Can I go through it now? Yay! Oh crap. They're slashing. Alright. We're doing our thing. Oh, oh. stupid fighting a tank like why would a guy with a sword even attack a tank what, what were they thinking oh god I sound like angry video game everybody saying that. what were you thinking he was really good back in the day now he kind of fell off I don't, I don't know what's going on he's doing too much what his what his show I think he was at his best when he didn't have a but uh, didn't have a budget and he wasn't trying to make everything look all cinematic. Hence cinematic. Like he's he's just better just being himself at that. Something, you know, for me to say. And I can say that because I'm a content creator way, way, way before he got started. I work for ABC News, so I know what I'm talking about. I had YouTube videos up a long time ago. I just had, didn't have my name on it. Oh shoot! I pushed a different button and now look at me.
And, and another thing about this game that's really driving me nuts out. I don't know where I'm going after a while. It's not like the game is big or anything. It's just it doesn't give you a direction of where to go next. Like I didn't know I was supposed to go there. Did I get all the enemies? Apparently I didn't because he ain't opening it up. So what am I supposed to do? And I don't see nobody. There's a witch call it over there. Do I shimmy? Nope. Okay. Oh my gosh. Where do I go? And it doesn't help when I look around the, the analog stick. The right analog stick is all inverted, so I can't look the way I want to look. It's making me go over the place and get dizzy. Okay, I see a little alleyway. Been nice, a little bit indication. That's one thing Ninja Gaiden did have. Shinobi don't have none of that. They're like, you figure it out type of games. Ugh. Oops. All right, this helicopter in the air, which means I have to do a lot of hopping. I don't know the developers who thought this was a smart idea knew, but I'm not Superman. I don't care about these ninjas. Oh, shoot. Oh, this is the worst type of balls fight when you have to hop and kill. Look, I look stupid doing this. I'm not even worried about the guys in the bottom. Come here, you. Where are you? Oh, uh, stupid inverted controls. Come here, you. Keep still. Oh my goodness. There we go. Keep still. There we go. All that was dumb. Like, I think when I was younger, I was distracted with the men on the bottom. I should have just destroyed the helicopter on top because all the other stuff did make no sense. This could have been a cool game. Like, I understand where Sony, uh, Sega was going with it. It's just the gameplay needed some tweaks. So common sense ideal should have been have there. The I don't need to be, if I'm a shinobi, I don't need to be fighting machines in, in any way, shape, or form. I need to be fighting strong opponents. Leave here at once. Can y'all imagine Naruto fighting a, a robot? That doesn't make sense. Oh my God. I did not mean for that to happen. I'm just going to see what the next level looks like. Cool, 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 cool. Let's take a quick look at the next level. Whoa! Boing! Hmm. What? We must be strong. Hurry. Take the sword. Take the sword. Take blah, 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 blah. Hurry. Okay. 
Take it. Do not forget, my spirit shall forever be by your side. Ha 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 ha. And only you can prevent forest fires. I'm supposed to kill this person? Alright, all right, I'm over it. That makes no sense. If you can make it that far, it's just stay alive and. Uh, so weird. What? This level looks no different from the last one. Gray is so depressing. Oh my god, I gotta hop around. Makes this game suck. I shouldn't be hopping. Subscribe if y'all remember this game or not. I was trying to get some compliments, but there's a lot of flaws and irritations into it. And woo! Can only take it for so long. Like, subscribe, ring a ding on the bell. I need more subscribers, like for real though. Like for real. Help a brother out. Ugh! I got prizes. I promise you, I'm going to announce soon. If I haven't already announced it. Some of it is going to be items, some of it might be cash. You never know. Informers Inc., I tell you, we're a company that's trying to do something. Well, I don't know about a company, but we're trying to, I'm trying to do something. I'm going to say, break it down to just me. And I will see you later. Thanks for watching. Please help support me so I can keep doing more videos. Also leave a comment thanks.